Welcome to IBC 2024. Discover game-changing innovations, explore new business models, and network with over 170 countries right here in Amsterdam. Well, Ross Video, no stranger to anyone in the broadcast industry and in fact celebrating 50 years this year. And I'm delighted to talk to Mark Cook now, who's the new Vice President of Sales for EMEA. How is the show going this year? Yeah, the show's growing fantastic so far this year. We've uh, had lots of footfall. It's great to see the industry bouncing back and more and more customers and clients coming to see what we've got to offer this year. As I said at the start, celebrating 50 years in the industry, but how would you describe your position? Yeah, this is a really special year for us. The um, company was founded in 1974 by John Ross, and this year we're commemorating and celebrating all of the things we've built on during that period. That's vision switchers, it's camera robotic systems, our hyper-converged um, routing and uh, processing platform Ultrix, as well as many other applications for the video production systems. Really, we're looking at giving customers as much choice as possible so that we can address all of their creative, technical and business needs in what's an emerging and evolving technology landscape. And how would you describe the trends in the industry right now? There's, there's two key trends I think I'm observing this year. Sustainability is a huge one, particularly, uh, particularly in Europe, Middle East and Africa. We, we're addressing that through a couple of areas. First of all, we have now achieved this year in our manufacturing facility in Canada, level one and level two net, uh, carbon net zero emissions, which is a fantastic achievement. But also from a product perspective, we have the hyper-converged Ultrix platform that I just mentioned. And this achieves sustainability through condensing space, uh, reduced weight, reduced wiring and raw material resource, as well as in increasing efficiency for how we're producing content. Number two is automation and AI. Uh, efficiency, effectiveness, and creativity are key topics for our customers. And how can we use tools like automation and AI to deliver on that? We have a couple of platforms, particularly debuting this year in IBC 2024 in Europe is our Artimo camera motion system. It's a robotic camera system that takes AI at its control layer using visionary software to allow more creative, more flexible shots, but also with camera tracking for facial tracking, so we can get consistency, repeatability, and improved efficiency. One of the really impressive things we're doing this year is showcasing our Spidercam cable camera system. Uh, this is the first time we've had it on the show floor at an IBC, and uh, the feedback's been tremendous. People are super excited to see a, a camera flying over their heads and, and the dynamic quality of the shots that they can get from that camera angle. And tell me about the uses for these products. Is it just the broadcast industry? So video production is growing in many different places. Broadcast is our core, that's where we came from originally in 1974, and we continue to address the needs of our broadcast customers. But video production is growing in so many different areas. We're working with venue clients and stadiums, we're working with live event spaces, and also growing corporate communications. So what's next then for Ross Video? The video production market continues to evolve. There's an ever-changing technology landscape and we're seeing increasing applications that are more diverse and more challenging with different business outcomes desired. I think there's a huge opportunity for us to continue to provide technology solutions to address those, both creatively, technically, but also helping our customers, both long-standing but also future customers, navigate that evolving technology landscape. And really that's the, the heart of what we're trying to achieve is help them solve the problems they have using video production technology to increase the engagement and the creative content that they produce for their audiences. I think it is partnership and collaboration all the way. Absolutely. Mark, thanks very much and enjoy the rest of the show. Thank you.